Welcome to the platform. This is Judy Jumbo Online Mathematics. Thank you for joining me once again. I remain on today's discussion will be on application of logarithmic functions to integration. We are going to learn how to integrate. Last time we discussed the derivative of logarithm to natural base e, and we said the derivative of the log of s to natural base e. We simply have it as 1 over s. Now, what do I invite the case? We want to look at the, the integral of 1 over x. And this symbol here represents an integral sign. And it's simply an indefinite integration because the limits of the functions are not given. And that's why we call it an indefinite integration. In integration, there are two types we have definite integration and indefinite. Now, here, the limits of the functions are not given. No values are given here. Therefore, we can say this one is simply an indefinite integration. Okay, we want to now look at the integral of 1 over x dx. This dx simply means that 1 over x is a derivative. Okay, the integral of 1 over x simply gives log s base e. Okay, we have it as an indefinite. We have to now say plus k or plus c. Plus k or plus c. That k represents the constant. Whenever you are given an indefinite integration, whereby the limits of the functions are not given, we simply represent our final answer as plus k or plus c. k or c simply represents the constant. Thank you for joining me on the platform. This is GB Jumbo Online Mathematics. Don't forget to like the page and also follow the page. For the YouTube channel, subscribe Mathematics Science Mega Tutorial. All the best.